Welcome, Salters and Aerials. I hope you're in a soft and safe place with lots of room. We're gonna jump right into today's class. We're gonna keep the format the same as we're running for right now. Keep it up. We're gonna switch to butt kickers. Great work. Back to running. Good job, guys. So you're going to straddle, arms up, touch each toe seven times. See if you can keep your rhythm. Alrighty. Now we're going to warm up our ankles. So we're going to do our calf raise, okay? So feet together. And five. You're gonna put your left foot in front. Good job. And five. And then your right foot in front. And five. Okay, so feet together. Five. Left foot in front. Good job. And five. And then your right foot in front. Alrighty. All of our stretches for our warm up will be for 10 today, so keep that in mind. We're gonna sit up, flex those feet, grab and pull, and hold for 10. Then we're gonna go to our butterfly. Same thing, push those knees down, and then hold for 10. Sit up into your straddle, and we're gonna put our arms up and reach over the top. All right, and now you're gonna hold or ten. And up tall, reach over to your right side. Good job, and hold for ten. And then we're gonna go to our pancake. We're gonna hold. All right, guys, back to the future here. We're gonna do some calf stretches. Okay? Since we're doing a lot of running and jumping this week, so we're gonna go to our push-up position. Okay, you're gonna push your hips up and get your shoulders open as possible and hide those ears. And then I'm gonna walk my feet up as close as I can while pushing my heels into the ground flat. And then we're gonna hold for 10. Really breathe through your stretch and try to feel it. 
Now, we're gonna, I'm gonna bend my knee slightly by lifting my heel off the ground, just an inch or two, maybe three. Okay, and then you're gonna hold that one, and you're gonna switch three times. And now let's do both knees. And now, and now we're gonna circle our ankles by pointing our toes, and then making a big circle outwards with our heels. We're gonna do that three times, and then we're gonna go inside three times. And then we're gonna repeat the bending knees and the ankle circles one more time. And then you're gonna switch three times. And both knees again. All right, good job. And we'll return to our regular... And we'll return to our... S We're gonna do our runner stretches. Hold for 10. Straight leg. So we're gonna reach forward. Count to 10. And hip forward. And count to 10. Then I'll repeat it on the other side. Hold for 10. And hip forward, and count to 10. All right, and now to our split. And now your right split. Hold for 10. And now your left split. You're gonna use that tape line to make sure that your body is in a straight line. Alrighty, now back to today's video. So for this drill, we're gonna use that TheraBand that we have. Remember, use a TheraBand, um, but do not wrap a jump rope or any other rope or a belt or anything else around your arms. But remember, it's behind your back, around the front of your shoulder, down your arm, around your forearm, below your elbow, and then into your hand between your thumb and your palm. Pause it if you need to now. Alrighty, so once you get to your band set, we're gonna review our positions. We have basket, we have T, we have V, and we have crown by our ears. So take it to the T, and then back to our crown. And then we're gonna review this again. Basket, T, V, and crown. Basket, T, V, and crown. Try with the releve. All 
Alright, now we're gonna add walks. Now remember, when we walk in gymnastics, we're gonna start by lifting our heel up, and then lifting the rest of our foot till our ball of the foot is on the ground, and then lifting till our toes come off the ground and stepping forward. Try to make it look as naturally and smooth as possible as you can. And now you're gonna practice your positions as you walk. Make sure your toe passes by your ankle. And then I wanna change the next position as I step forward, okay? Don't think about it too much, just keep practicing. All right, and now that we've done forward, we're gonna try backwards, okay? It's a little bit more confusing, but it's a challenge. See if you can get it. Take your time. Don't feel like you need to rush, okay? Remember, lift the heel first, ball of your foot, and then stretch with the toe, feeling for your tape line. Okay, remember, make sure you have lots of space around you, nothing hard, you wanna be on a soft surface. All right, so now we're gonna review our hurdles. Now there are two types of hurdles. Okay, there's one hurdle for vault, and there's one hurdle for floor. Now with our hurdle, we want to add the arm circle. And then we hurdle for floor, those arms go up over your head, and they stay, there's no circle. Okay, now for vault, we wanna make sure we stand up tall and not go forward, so our feet always want to be in front of us. So vault has an arm circle, and then floor does not have an arm circle. So you wanna make sure that you make that distinction in your hurdle. All right, so I'm gonna show you each one one more time, and really go for it. So here's floor. Make sure your core is tight, your legs are tight. And here's vault. Now we're gonna try that three times. You can pause it and try some more. So that one was for floor, arm stayed up. And then number two. This is from running from vault. So, see how the arms circled and go up? Now 
Great work, guys. We're going to review our jumps today. Now remember the last video, we practiced our straight jump. We practiced a tuck jump. And some straddle jumps. So today we're going to add turning. So we have half turn. And full turn. Now when you turn, you want to make sure you always turn towards the direction of the shoulder that your cartwheel leg or handstand leg is. So, so whichever foot's in front, if you're lefty, it's a left. If you're right foot, then you're right. Go ahead and let's try it a couple times with me. All right, so now we're gonna try to put those jumps into some combinations. If you make a mistake, just dance it out. Feel free to try your own. I'm gonna start with straight, straight. And ready to straight jump half turn. Remember, work on that balance. Very good job today, guys. Straight jump, full turn. We're gonna join Monday's class again, and we're gonna do our same stretch. We're gonna keep that format the same this week. We might add in some new things here and there like we did our calves and Achilles, but we wanna make sure we're getting those stretches in. Remember, these are 45 seconds. All right, we're gonna hold these last stretches for 45 seconds each. We have our pipe, and then you're gonna hold for 45. And then we're gonna flex our feet, and again reach forward, hold for 45. All right. We're gonna hold these last stretches for 45 seconds each. We have our pipe, and then you're gonna hold for 45. All right. And now we're gonna go to our straddle. On each side, still hold 10.
Once you get that pancake, really stretch it. Number 45. And now your right split. Now, when you count, maybe sing a silly song and just keep watching the video. And then our left split. What was your favorite thing today? Think about that while you're stretching. You can also think about what cool skills you're going to be excited to learn once you get back into the gym. All right, guys, you made it through your first workout. So we're just gonna let the stretch be our last thing. All right, Saltos and Aerials, you've completed your second class for this week. Great work. I hope you're excited and ready for our next video. And we can't wait to see you back at the gym in Broadway.
this one for 30 seconds.